，这就是西弗吉尼亚的首府 c a p i t a l 外表看起来真的不起眼。Oh, Looks like a security officer or something. Hi, would you have, excuse me? Would you have a moment to talk about the building、uh, for video?、Uh, <laughs> I mean, it's our first. You're not allowed. Okay. That, yeah, no worries. Okay. No, no worries. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> okay. You too. Thanks. Yeah, you just are doing. Okay, so we're we're here in Charleston, West Virginia,、uh, in the Capitol building, and、uh, these are the entrances for the、uh, governor's office.、Um, this is the governor's reception hall, and there's an echo here because of the.、Uh, I guess there's a. What's、uh, called echo? It's an echo, right? We just said beautiful marble halls. Mm -hmm. And if you can listen, you can hear the echo. Yeah, it's beautifully built building. 好像就是回声 echo. Echo, yes. 能听到那个当当当当当自己的声音慢慢衰减下去 I'm, I'm not sure of the history of this building, but it's、uh, it's a beautiful building inside and out. <laughs> mm -hmm. 就是你可以进来参观的 welcome. And there's bears in the hallway too. What's this? That's the rotunda. Golden. Yeah, that's the right. It's the golden one. Can you see? Obviously, the the governor's reception. Yes. Part of the part of the capital. This is actually the attorney general rotunda. Okay.、Uh, they do have some events here, like press conferences.、Uh, the governor's reception room is actually located on the opposite side of the capital. It'll be the same exact kind of setup, but you will see. Like a, a room off from the side of it, and you'll see the governor's picture of him and his family, and,、right. and he goes there to give his his press conferences and his meetings. So, and is there anything、uh, symbolic of the echo? No,、uh, I don't believe so. I think it's just the materials they they use to build it, the marble、okay. and、yeah. the tall ceilings. But it it is working here very well, an echo. Yes, it, it does work very well. It, it, it almost deletes the need for a podium if, if you have an event here. Exactly. Yeah, that would make sense. Sure. And bears are uh, uh, in in the hallways. Yeah, that's our、uh, our state animal, I believe, or the state、yeah. bear.、Uh, I'm not sure if it's the actual animal, but yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So,、uh, what's your name? Brandon. Brandon Chris. Okay. It's my wife Reese. Nice to meet y'all. So you're all just passing through? Yeah, we're on our way to Virginia. Okay. Cool. Cool. Gonna get back to work. Yeah. So you're do <coughs> doing this all through the nation, or? Yeah,、uh, in some parts of the world. <laughs> okay. Cool. Yeah. We... So what do you think about West Virginia so far?、Uh, it's interesting. Yeah. Interesting. You know, there's. It's old-fashioned. Yeah, old-fashioned. Yeah. yeah.、Uh, he thought that we were a couple、mm -hmm. coming into the capital to get married because he's supposed to meet、uh, a couple here to be married by the clerk or a judge. In in the courthouse,、uh. <laughs> he thought that we were getting married. I said, well, I said, I, so I said, we're we're, we're married, married already. Turn turn turn, 转到这边来，有一个大型的圆柱厅。Yeah. 对。那边走过来的时候觉得很小，然后转到里面来很大很大，全部是汉白玉的样子。我对材质不是很认得。就上楼上去的。Give you a, a guided tour, and it can show you like、uh, places in the building and things like that. Uh, what's the name? Tour, tour. tour.、Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah, and tell you like everything about the building itself. They <laughs> <laughs> 他让我跟着他走 Okay. Well, these are all the members of our House of Delegates. There's 100 members that represent all、uh, 55 counties of West Virginia. Oh.
走到这脑袋电梯来，我现在走出来，我现在跟着这位帅哥走，他要给我介绍一下。就是最早修建它的时候是这样的。OK。哇、wow.。This is our open foyer. Typically, it's a very long hallway that extends past this temporary wall. Inside of the rotunda, you typically see the inside of the dome itself, and our total capital stands 292 feet. There's a 23 karat gold leaf on top of it. It's equivalent to about 10 pounds worth of gold that sits on our dome entirely. Inside of the rotunda, and this is a smaller picture here, you'll be able to see a nine foot tall statue of Robert C. Byrd, one of the oldest running senators in our nation. Uh, the giant crystal chandelier that weighed 15,000 pounds of Czech Republic crystal. And then in the middle of everything would be what we consider the well. It's a, an observatory area where if you're on the ground floor, you can observe the inside of the dome from that floor. And if you're on this floor, the first floor, you can look down and see the ground floor itself. But this is how it happened. See this little photograph here. This is a year prior to the completion of our capital in 1931. Wow. It began construction in 1924 and didn't finish until 1932, making it an eight year long project. Yeah. So it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. This is just a top, and the, uh, this is step, just a go. Outside? Uh, those steps actually go to the second floor. Uh, there's more offices, uh, it, but there's typically a uh, door outside here. You can even see it looking look at this smaller photograph here. If we were on this floor here, there would be a door leading to the outside. Oh. But there is one leading to the courtyard out here oh. that we can see later. So we just visit, we go um, here, mm -hmm. yeah, just we, on, on the top. Yeah, we wouldn't be able to get up here. This is for only maintenance and like uh, staff members. People who work here can only get up there. No, it's a work here, so no sit, no sit here. Yeah, yeah, they have like uh, fissures, like cracks on the inside here mm -hmm. uh, from water damage, from rain damage. Oh. And it uh, seeped in and created essentially kind of like black mold on the inside of our dome. So they're kind of stripping this out, kind of clearing off all the uh, damage, and they're going to replace it and repair it. And the same for our exterior dome, our outside dome as well. <sighs> Amazing. Mm -hmm. I don't see this capital like this capital. It's different. Yeah, it's it's a little bit different. Uh, this one's actually four and a half feet taller than the nation's capital in D.C. But it's oh. got a very same similar shape to it, that Greek revival style of architecture. Now all the marble that we see here was actually cut here on the grounds, and they were imported here using 700 train cars. Uh, uh, this old courthouse you know, look kind of the same, you know, beautiful yeah. marble floors. Yeah, very similar. Very yeah. yeah. Light. It's locked. Yeah. Go to the other side of the House of Delegates and see if the other chamber is open. Okay. So this is the Senate. This is the Senate.
just the, having it their own way, but it was a national monument before. All the brass work is completely original from the 1930s, too. You see all the great detail on the you know, leaves and various uh, decorations that they have on the walls. In the courtyard, just beyond the fountain, there is the 35th copy of our Liberty TV. Bell. It's oh wow! See the see, honey, look through. See the Liberty Bell? Uh -huh. It's a copy of the, the Liberty Bell that's in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And since we're the 35th state of the union, that's the 35th copy. Wow. Sugar maple or state tree, the red oak, and the magnolia. And those same trees can be found here on the Capitol grounds as well. The symbols that run on the walls as well has a significant meaning for our state. In the middle between the two white pillars is the symbol of justice, represented by the line of the scales and sword. To the right of it is a shield with two pickaxes crossed behind it, representing industry. The Greek goddess Athena with her eye represents education. The bull with the ears of corn hanging on its horns represents agriculture. So, are, are these the flowers that are made of wood? Is it uh, plaster. Plaster. Mm -hmm. saw before the uh, we got on the elevator this is where all them all of them will sit mm -hmm. all 100 members we have 34 members of the senate right. this is the uh, state legislature state government That chandelier. Do you know where that was from? The chandelier? Uh, the chandelier actually came from the Czech Republic. Wow. Uh, that's crystal to coming from that country. Yeah. And that went up the same time our capital did in 1932, making it 87 years old. I have to take a picture of that. It's 15 years old, crystal. It's worth a million dollars. For, right, right. Because right. you have a separation of state laws and federal laws. Mm -hmm. State laws can be individualized, but federal laws can overview uh, state laws. And there's a, right, and there is a precedent where, where state laws have to follow federal exactly. laws. Exactly. We have our wooden seal. Wooden seal. It's right in the middle there. Uh, Alex, Alex Griffith. 
Thanks, Alex. Thank you, uh, Nick. Uh, you're, Thanks you're, for the tour of the, yeah. of the West Virginia House of Representatives and the Capitol building. Uh, it's my pleasure. Yeah. I hope you uh, travel in China. Absolutely. So I hope you and uh, go into other place, good place. Yeah. Mm -hmm. if, if you want to go, if you want to go to China and travel, uh, you can reach us through the YouTube okay. site and just say who you are, and where where you are, and we'll okay. remember. And then you, if you go to China, uh, certain parts of China where we have family, or my wife has family, we'll, they'll show you. They'll take you to the hotel <laughs> and show you. That'd be amazing. Okay. It's it's. Okay. Uh, it's a, it is. 给他留下了我们频道的名字，然后希望他得收到中国去旅游，然后我会很欢迎他过去。So if you want to go to China, just let us know. Alright.参观了一圈出来，其实真的挺感动的。然后他们他们人很热情，然后就是你能感受到他们那种用心跟那种帮助，所以在美国的时候。国会议员工作的地方，嗯，你也可以进来看一看，反正就是一种体验哈。希望大家的时候喜欢西弗吉尼亚，给我印象真的特别好。